Hey! It's been a while since I've made a Pro vs Pro video and you guys were really into it last time I had a series on the best Pro saves. Now I'm back and this time we're going to have a Pro vs Pro series on the best 0 second goal. Alright, now before you freak out and spam the comments with Justin has the best 0 second goal, just hold off for a little. The time to discuss Justin's goal will be at a later video and who knows, you might have changed your mind. For this video, we have Ahmed and Daniel against each other for the best 0 second goal. Now, instead of just showing the videos and letting you guys debate off just that, I want to make sure you guys are actually thinking a little and not just picking your favorite player among the two. Starting off with Ahmad, his goal was ridiculous to pull off. He flipped his car upside down and managed to redirect the ball into the goal after the clock had hit 0 seconds. Chicago sends it over the halfway, but Senzo's waiting for him. It's back and forth. It's both teams posture for OT. G2 will quite happily take it. Sandrock, they don't want to go there. Ahmad! Sends another redirect straight into the G2 net. 3 0! Oh! Anticipate no more! Sandrock Gaming have arrived! What's also good about his goal is that it secured a three game sweep against G2 Esports, one of the best North American teams. He also scored his goal during the Fall Major LAN event, which I'm sure was an added layer of stress and nerves on top of the fact that it was Sandrock Gaming's first time ever competing in an RLCS tournament. The addition of new regions meant that teams like Sandrock and Tokyo Verde had a chance to compete in official tournaments. Sandrock especially has a large fan base from people all around the world, so they definitely must have felt the pressure while competing. On the other hand, we have Daniel. We all know who Daniel is by now. Probably the most anticipated up and coming RLCS player who was finally able to compete after hitting 15 years of age. When this kid got into the scene with Space Station Gaming, he really put on a show and it was nice to see Arsenal and Redos hyping him up so much. Four, but it does require precision on defense. Big stops, 8 seconds left, Space Station Hound and looking for more and more demolitions just trying to open up the goal here but the two man defense standing strong as Arsenal puts it back down, clock expired, long play to midfield, Daniel holding on to it in the sky but Justin ah. able to take it away from him, out of boost, dumps it into the back third, Reddles will slow it down, pick up boost, dribble this one around, he's going to have a long way to go, he's going to on one, out to Arsenal, oh, yeah. trying to get the pass back into Reddles, putting it high, There's where's Daniel, Daniel? into tie and send it to overtime, he's oh, in, yeah. what a play, Space Station! <laughs> Keep him alive! All right, Rettles the control on the dribble out. Perfect. The dump to Arsenal. Perfect. And then it's all about can you beat NRG on one last go? And Daniel's able to squeeze one into the net. Oh, man. What makes Daniel's zero second goal so special is that it secured a game one win in a grand final regional against arguably the best North American team, NRG. Aside from the pressure of a grand final, Daniel had a lot of eyes on him. Almost everyone who follows RLCS was looking forward to seeing him perform and knowing the amount of people that are specifically watching you play can really get to you. That's it for comparing the two goals. Let me know what you guys think in the comments of who scored the better 0 second goal. Also, if you have suggestions of 0 second goals that are worthy against the winner of this round, let me know as well and I'll check it out. That's all for this video, thanks for watching.